to another video. If you couldn't tell by the previous montage, we are in Florida. So we are staying with family. So I will not be vlogging my niece and nephew. So it's going to be a little bit tricky when I am with them. So we are going out together as a family and we are going to go to World of Disney and just walk around Disney Springs can't tell there's kids in the house like I said we landed in Florida at 8 a.m. so we've just been relaxing I am running on 40 minutes of sleep I haven't slept at all today I just had like a big coffee and then played with the kids when we got here and we just kind of figured out like what we want to do for the day so yeah I'm getting ready so that we can go to Disney Springs and have a nice little family night we want to get to bed early tonight because we are going to Epcot super early tomorrow and we are staying until park closed so we have a very long day tomorrow and it's like two o'clock right now so I think we're just going to go to Chef Art Smith's homecoming for dinner and then just like walk around and check out World of Disney of course and so I will bring you guys along with whatever we do at Disney Springs. So we came out to Chef Art Smith's homecoming and they were able to see us right away. So if you're wondering what kind of food they have, it's a lot of barbecue. I think I definitely need to try the mac and cheese. And I think for dinner I'm gonna get the fried chicken and donuts because that sounds really good. And then uh, since everyone else is drinking, I got one too. And I got the strawberry lemonade moonshine. So let's see how this is. So I changed my mind. I'm actually gonna get the Art's famous fried chicken. And then instead of the mashed potatoes, I'm gonna get the mac and cheese because that one comes with the cheddar biscuit, which I definitely wanna try, so yeah. All right, so initial reaction, I think that the <laughs> strawberry lemonade moonshine is kind of bland. I feel like I need to finish it and then come up with a solid conclusion. So we got the fried chicken, cheddar biscuit, and mac and cheese, and this looks so good. It comes with a side of pickles, and this was $32. Thanks, Brad. <laughs> just left homecoming and I would give my meal a 9 out of 10. The drink ended up being pretty good once I actually finished it and the food was pretty good. It's just sitting really heavy because that was the only thing I've eaten today. So yeah, Chef Art Smith's homecoming is a 9 out of 10 if you want to try it. So we're now in World of Disney and we're looking at all of the Christmas merch and I really like this water bottle because it's so sparkly in person. I love it. I just don't need it, but it's so freaking cute. And I high-key want the Christmas Crocs. I just don't need them, because I just got the pink ones. But they are very cute. Wait, do I, do I need these? No? These are $65. They have like a ton, too. I know, but they're cute. So I know they've had this jacket for a while. And I look at it every time I come here. I don't know how much it is. How much is it? It is $65. I just, I don't know. It's not a necessity, but it is a nice, like, staple jacket. This is my first time seeing the green plaid ears in person, which I did almost buy these during the fall season, and I'm glad I didn't. I don't really like them in person. And they also have the Mickey Snow Globe ears. These are pretty cute. I just don't know how I feel about the plastic like material oh I've been eyeing these up for a while because I really like the tiara I just have like I feel like I have a lot of pink ears and I don't need them so something that we've been waiting to hit shop Disney is these Santa ears these are super cute I want these I just don't need them and these are $35 and I'm gonna give my advice that literally no one asked for. Well, not advice, but opinion. Um, I absolutely hate this collection, so sorry if you like it, but mm -mm, absolutely not. And they also have the Piglet Pink collection in here. We have the Starbucks cup, the Spirit jersey. And I actually really like the Piglet Pink Lounge Fly. I think this is so cute. I just don't even use the rose gold one, and it's funny because I bought it off this exact rack um, a few months ago. And I do really like this. How much is this one? It's probably like 95. Yeah. Let me let me think about it because mm, I I do love her. 
And I also know that these uh, champagne glasses are new. They're much more like gold in person than what I was seeing online, but they're still really cute. $18. Okay, not too, too bad. I feel like they're like nice for a special celebration, but I wouldn't buy them just because I don't need them. Do you like that? Too much pink in me. No, never. Yeah. I just don't. <laughs> ER. I just don't like the polka dots in this, but I have this in my hands and you guys know what happens when I put lounge flies in my hands. I usually walk out with them. Yeah, see like the polka dots are just not, not working for me. Mm -mm. And I already have the Crocs too, which is another reason why I'm like really eyeing this up. And any Marie fans, they do have that set that Cassie was able to get at Disneyland in World of Disney finally and this one is really cute and then they also have the matching pants and then little like clip-in ears and a t-shirt they're all actually really cute guys this is only $50 and I feel like this is such a good little present there is quite a bit of Christmas decor out at Springs which is pretty cute but honestly I have to say that going into Wad. Right now, everything is pretty much on Shop Disney. There's nothing that like really caught my eye besides the lounge fly. So I was looking for the long sleeve Walt Disney World like green t-shirt with like the lights and they didn't have that. So yeah, relatively disappointed and I didn't buy anything because I don't use the lounge fly that I have. So I can't buy myself another one. Um, but now we're going to go check out Basin because I have never been there. So maybe I'll buy some soaps or something. So you can make your own candle, two for $25 or they are $15 each. So they have Mickey, Minnie, Daisy, Donald, some frozen ones. These are really cute. That's actually really cool. That's very satisfying. It's probably not like great for your skin though. Wait, how do you know how many ounces it is? Does it say it on the back? This looks like an acne, like, barcode. <laughs> that is really cute though, but yeah. I don't know, $8 for a bar soap. They are very cute though. This one is so satisfying to look at. They look like little, like erasers. But I'm not a fan of the smell. This is a citrusy one. So I wanna try this sugared shortbread body scrub. Bread. <laughs> Are you focusing on my one <laughs> broken nail? That makes your hands really soft. Wait, no, my hands are like so soft. They're forty dollars each, or two for seventy. Oh no. Ooh, that looks so cool. I feel like if you have a tub with jets. Yeah, extra cool. Uh, just moving around will get it. Yeah, just going. moving around. Oh, this one is really pretty. And this little Rapunzel teacup. This is a hundred dollars with Rapunzel and Flynn on the spoon. And then a Rapunzel figurine for four fifty-five. Wait, I don't know what the name of the store is, but it's right next to a basin, and it's very cute in here, but also very expensive. That's beautiful. There's no price on these. Very pretty though. It looks rose gold on camera, but in person it's gold, and that is beautiful. Um, you wanna buy this for me for my birthday? <gasps> wow. Good morning guys, it is the next day and I uh, did not finish the vlog yesterday because I was so freaking tired. We really didn't do that much yesterday anyway, so I'm sorry if this vlog was a boring one, but as you can tell, I am wearing my Guardian's fit, so we are off to Epcot. We have a uh, very early return time, so today's vlog should be so much more fun. So make sure that you subscribe and stay tuned for that, and make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, and stay tuned for next week's video, and I will see you guys real soon. Bye!